Okay, so now we'll use the previous lemma to prove a theorem. So let x be the finite product of n topological spaces with the product topology. Let y be a topological space. And let the set of functions f sub i be the set of coordinate functions of the function f mapping y into the product space x. Then the function f is continuous if and only if each of the coordinate functions mapping y into x sub i is continuous. So proof. Suppose that the function f is continuous. Notice that the ith coordinate map is the composition of the ith projection map with the function f. So as each projection map is continuous and the function f is continuous each coordinate function f sub i is continuous so conversely suppose that each coordinate function is continuous and let V be an open set in the space X then by the previous theorem the inverse image of the set V under the map F is the intersection of the inverse images under the maps f sub i of the sets u sub i where each set u sub i is open in the corresponding space x sub i. And so each of the inverse images under the maps f sub i of the sets u sub i is open in the space y and hence the finite intersection of these open sets is open in the space y that is the inverse image of the set V under the map F is open in the space Y. And thus the function F mapping Y into the product space X is continuous. Okay, so now we will begin to consider the topological properties of the product topology on a finite product set. So first we'll look at separation conditions. So as a theorem, let x be the finite product of n topological spaces with the product topology. If each of the factor spaces x sub i 
is T2, or Hausdorff. Then the product space is T2, or Hausdorff. So proof. Let the ordered n tuples x and y be two ordered n tuples in the product space x, where the ordered n tuple x is not equal to the ordered n tuple y. Then there exists at least one index i such that the ith component of the ordered n tuple x is not equal to the ith component of the ordered n tuple y. So as the space x of i is t2 or Hausdorff, there exist open neighborhoods u sub i of the point x of i and v sub i of the point y sub i in the space x of i such that the intersection of these two neighborhoods is empty. Now as the ith projection map is continuous. The inverse image of the set u sub i under the ith projection map is an open neighborhood. Of the ordered n tuple x and the inverse image of the set v sub i under the ith projection map is an open neighborhood. Of the ordered n tuple y in the product space x such that the intersection of these neighborhoods is the inverse image under the ith projection map of the intersection of the sets u sub i and v sub i, which is the inverse image of the empty set, which is the empty set. And hence, the product space x is T2 or Hausdorff. So as an exercise, let x be the finite product of n topological spaces with the product topology. Prove that if each of the spaces x of i is T1, or Frechet, then the product space is T1, or Frechet. And if each of the factor spaces x of i is T0, or Komolgorov, then the product space is T0, or Komolgorov. Okay, so next we'll begin to consider connectedness in a product uh, topology. So first we'll prove 
a lima. The image of a connected space under a continuous map is connected. So proof. Let X and Y be topological spaces such that the space X is connected let the function f mapping x into y be continuous and let the set z which is the direct image of the connected space x under the map f be a subspace of the space y. Then, as the function f mapping x into y is continuous, the function g mapping x into z obtained by restricting the codomain of the function f is continuous and clearly this function is a surjection now assume that the space z is disconnected then there exists a separation of the space Z by the sets U and V now since the sets U and V are non-empty, open subsets of the space Z and the function G is both continuous and surjective. The inverse image of the set U under the map G and the inverse image of the set V under the map G are non-empty, open subsets of the space X. Now as the union of the sets U and V is the entire space Z, the union of the inverse images of these sets under the map G is the inverse image of the union of these sets under the map G which is the inverse image of the entire subspace Z which is the entire space X and as the intersection of U and V is the empty set the intersection of the inverse images of these sets under the map G is the inverse image of the intersection of the sets which is the inverse image of the empty set which is the empty set that is the pair of inverse images of U and V under the map G is a separation of the space X contradicting the fact that 
that the SpaceX is connected. And hence, by contradiction, Space Z, which is the direct image of the connected SpaceX under the map F, is connected. Okay, so we, we will use this lemma to prove a theorem. So let X be the finite product of N topological spaces with the product topology. If the product space X is connected, then each of the factor spaces X sub I is connected. So proof. Suppose that the product space is connected. Then each of the sets X of I, which is the direct image under the ith projection map of the connected space X, is connected. Since each projection map is continuous. So notice that the contrapositive of the previous theorem is also true, that is, if any one of the factor spaces x sub i is disconnected, then the product space is disconnected. So as a, an exercise, let x be the finite product of n topological spaces with the product topology. Show that if the pair of sets u sub i and v sub i is a separation, of the space x sub i, then the pair of inverse images of these sets under the ith projection map is a separation of the product space. Okay, so we will end here for today. Next time we will continue to look at properties of the product topology on a finite product space. And then we will move on to the product topology on any arbitrary product space as well as a related topology known as the box topology. So I hope you have enjoyed the 18th lecture. Thanks for watching.